Konnichiwa and welcome to Sumo Prime Time. I'm Hiro Morita. It's the opening day of the May tournament. This time, Yokozuna Teru no Fuji is back in action. So we're all set to begin what should be another exciting 15 days. Now, before we get to the bout, how about we show you a ceremony which took place in the Kokugikan yesterday to get the main stage ready for the May contest. Doskoi Sumo Prime Time! Six grand tournaments are held each year. The new dohyo or the mounted ring is made before each tournament. Yesterday on Saturday, the dohyo matsuri or the ring purification ceremony was held. The ceremony always takes place the day before the opening day of a grand tournament. Dohyo Matsuri is a ceremony to consecrate the ring. It is held to pray for a rich harvest, universal peace, and safety on the Dohyo for the next 15 days. The chief Gyoji referee serves as the presiding Shinto priest. He is accompanied by two assistant Gyoji. A squared hole is dug in the middle of the dojo to place the offerings to the deities. Six lucky charms are buried. They are salt, rice, Dried squid, dried seaweed, Japanese nutmeg, and Japanese chestnuts. To mark the completion of the ceremony, Yobirashi ring announcers walk around the ring three times with taiko drumming. So what did you think of Dohyo Matsuri? The ceremony is a reminder to all of us that sumo is not just a sport, but it's a Shinto ritual and a very important Japanese culture. Now, the stage is set and we're all ready for battle. All right, we start day one with a battle involving this much anticipated returnee to the top division, and that is Asanoyama. Former Ozeki Asanoyama on day one took on Chio Shoma. Asanoyama locks up, Asanoyama This is Asanoyama defeats Shoshoma, no problem! Asanoyama gets the right hand inside, goes forward and defeats Shoshoma. Asanoyama wins in Makinochi for the first time since the 2021 May tournament. Welcome back Asanoyama! Next up is the newly promoted Sekiwake Wakamoto Haru. He took on Endo. A spirited Tachai by the two. They lock up in Hidari Yotsu, left hand inside, right hand outside. Endo backpedals. Wakamoto Haru looks to be in good shape right here. Just about the middle of the dojo. Wakamoto Haru puts his forehead on Endo. Endo goes down. Wakamoto Haru with a strong Watenage buries Endo. Wakamoto Haru gets the win on his Sekiwake debut day. Shin Sekiwake Wakamoto Haru gets the W. 1 and 0. Very impressive performance by Wakamoto Haru. 
Dai Eisho returned to Sekiwake. Remember, he came so close to winning his second title in March, and this time he badly wants to accomplish the feat. Here he is taking on Nishiki Fuji. Dai Eisho with his usual all guns blazing offense. He locks up and he goes forward and he knocks Nishiki Fuji out. Impressive performance by Dai Eisho. He goes to 1 and 0. Oh. Chris Hachiai, good follow through, and he crushes Nishiki Fuji. Dai Eisho, the returnee to Sekiwake, is off to a very auspicious start. 1 and 0. Oh. Now, here is the winner of the previous tournament in March, Kiribayama. He is gunning for promotion to the second highest rank of Ozeki. On day one, he fought Midori Fuji. Sharp touch eye by the two. Midori Fuji pushes Kiribayama to the edge, but Kiribayama escapes with a nice pull down and he gets off to a good start with a W. Kiribayama. Who's gunning for promotion to Ozeki gets the win on the opening day. A little scary moment for Kiribayama at the edge, but Kiribayama remained with poise and confidence, and he's able to get by Midori Fuji, a very dangerous opponent. Kiribayama wins. Ozeki Takakeisho is a Kadoban Ozeki, which means that he has to win a majority of his matches this time to keep his current status. On the opening day of the May tournament, he took on a hard pusher thruster, Abi. Oh, judged by Abi. Abi knocks Takakeisho back, and Takakeisho circles away and takes Abi out. Takakeisho remains calm and defeats Abi at the edge. Not really an impressive sumo on the Ozeki's part, but Takakeisho keeps his poise, remains in the ring, and takes Abi out. Ozeki Takakeisho, the Kadoban Ozeki Takakeisho, is off to a very good start. One and all. Oh. Finally, here is Yokozuna Teruno Fuji. Now he is looking for a major redemption after setting out four consecutive tournaments. On the opening day, he faced off against former Ozeki Shodai. Good attack by Teruno Fuji. Shodai takes Teruno Fuji to the edge, but Teruno Fuji had the answer. Teruno Fuji escapes with a nice throw with the right hand and the Shodai had Teruno Fuji on the ropes. But Teruno Fuji was able to escape. He dodges a bullet and the Yokozuna gets the win on the opening day. Shodai gave his best effort, but the Yokozuna was standing tall in the end. Tenno Fuji is the victor. Alright, that's gonna do it for day one of the May tournament. How did your favorite wrestlers perform today? Now, the going gets tough, then the tough gets going day by day, and we'll see how all the combatants handle their business in the next 14 days. All right, that's going to do it for Sumo Prime Time. We'll be back tomorrow on day two, so please join us then. And also,
don't forget to join us in our first ever live streaming show coming up in a few days. I am really excited for the show and I'm really excited to meet all of you too. So that's gonna do it. I'm Hiro Morita. Arigato for watching and sayonara. Hey, thanks for watching Sumo Prime Time. If you're enjoying our channel, make sure and click and subscribe and check out all of our contents.